A slow start, but uh, <laughs> how do you think the effort was, you know, as a, as a total package? Uh, I don't think the effort was there. I mean, we didn't. Uh, we talked after the game about what lessons you can take away from this, and uh, it's obvious that we didn't, uh, as cliche as it is, we didn't play a 60-minute game. So um, uh, there, this league is too competitive for you to take periods of time off and expect to win. So I'm, I'm not happy with the effort, but nor are any of our players are happy with the effort either. What were the issues that uh, stuck out for you, you know, specifically? I think the other team uh, outworked us. They came in, they won all the puck battles, they were... Uh, Anything loose uh, that was 50-50 was always theirs, and um, I think they uh, skated and were a lot hungrier at the beginning. Um, we got a little desperate as the game went along, but um, you know, not many teams in this league have the ability to come back from a 4 nothing deficit. So, Coach, you're down one nothing early in the contest. He didn't even get a shot on their goal yet, and you call a timeout. What was said on the bench there? Just a, a reset and relax type conversation? Uh, I would say quite the contrary to that. Uh, it was more of um, um, essentially we need a better effort than this. And I wasn't going to let it. I was hoping that that would be a, a change. I've done that in the past. Um, but uh, I don't think it had the desired effect. Now down 4-3 late in the game. You guys pull the goaltender, get the extra attacker out there. Was that kind of reminiscent of, well, I kind of wish I had that time out now? Yeah, you'd always wish that. However, um, the girls are prepared on what they're supposed to do in that situation. Um, it's a question of whether they're thinking clearly and can execute on, you know, the structure off the face-off. But uh, you know, I, I, I would rather call the timeout earlier in the game and try and effect a change than to be at the end of the game wishing I called it at the beginning. Was there any thoughts? I know she came into this game with a 125 goals against average, but she let in three goals within the first 11 minutes of the game, and then uh, we'll say a softy on the fourth one. Uh, was there any thoughts in your head of possibly putting Peyton in this match? Uh, the thought crossed my mind, but no, I didn't pull the trigger on that. Um, and we certainly had uh, discussions between periods all the time about scenarios like that, no matter what the score is. Um, but uh, no, we, we felt that, uh, you know, Kelly has earned the right in her career to uh, persevere through that, just as many of our other players have. So um, we decided to stick with it. That, that being said, you know, the next game we'll reassess who's playing and who's not playing, and uh, uh, we'll try and move forward from there. 24 hours until the Nipissing Lakers, who are nipping at your heels in the OUA standings. Uh, it's safe to say that if the team came out the way it did in the second and third period, it's going to be a great game tomorrow. If you come out the way you did in the first, it might get ugly early. Uh, is that a safe assessment? <laughs> That's pretty safe, John. Yeah, <laughs> uh, we have a good rivalry with them. I think when you play people in the playoffs, it starts to generate a little animosity. And uh, certainly, our game in North Bay earlier this year, I think we lost one nothing, maybe. Uh, I think it was a pretty close game, and uh, um, uh, Darren's done a good job with his team up there, and they compete every night. So uh, you know, we've got to respect them a lot more than we apparently respected Laurentian when they came in today. And final question for me, just uh, specifically, what do you think this team needs to improve? If you could take one aspect, I know as a coach you're probably going through the list of things that you'd like to see improved upon within the next 24 hours, but if you had to pick one, what would it be? I think some uh, one thing would just be our consistency in our effort. Um, there was a little bit, I don't know what it is and why it happens, um, but uh, you know, you've got to play the entire game and make sure you bring your A game all the time. Um, I was saying after the game that we are the national champions, uh, may not have all the players from last year's team and we have new players on our team, but um, people are bringing their A game to play against us every time and we just can't put our equipment on and expect to win games. So the effort has to be a much higher than that.